Hanun hor ye vort vo ye vo kuin serpo amen. Good evening, my dear brothers and sisters. Today I am sitting in the deck and I am going to talk to you about something that happens around here a lot. So every time we come outside of our home and we sit in the nature, we have this little backyard here. We notice a couple of rabbits that come and try to eat the grass. But every time that they notice us, they try to escape. Especially one of them looks very afraid from us. But this happened last year. Through time and gradually, they started to know us. Our faces, I guess, our voices felt very familiar to them. So even though they will still be afraid from us, they will not escape like they used to. But rather, they will wait, they will make sure that there is no threat against their lives, and then they will continue to have their supper, their lunch, or even their breakfast. You know, this simple thing reminded me of our relationship with God. Many of us, especially those who are in the beginning of their journey, faith journey with God, are like these rabbits. They are very afraid from God. Every time they hear about God, about religion, about the church, about the Bible, anything that is related to Christianity they escape because they don't know anything about it. Others have very wrong idea about Christianity, about our faith. They think that our God is this angry person who is waiting for them to do something so that he can immediately punish them. Others think that Christianity is about commandments and rules and regulations do this and do that and if you miss something then you will not inherit the kingdom of God the kingdom of heaven but in fact my dear brothers and sisters God is a loving father and he wants to have a relationship with us so we are invited to be like the rabbits that after knowing us after having this relationship with us through time by listening to our voices by seeing our faces by recognizing our presence are here are not afraid and they can freely go around this place get their food and in their mind they are very much assured that no wrong thing is going to happen to them we have to be the same in our relationship with god my dears god wants to have this relationship with us and the more we give time and effort to listen to his voice and become familiar with his love with his commandments with the life that he wants to grant us as we read in the gospel of saint john chapter 10 the abundant life the more we will feel that there is no threat against us the more we will love this god and the more we will enjoy to have a relationship with him may god bless you all and may god become the familiar dad and father that we all look in our lives. Amen.